So Brian and uh, Summers were over here to record Super Game Force, but we had some stupid issues with our uh, computer, my computer, and the Gato may be dead, so we don't know. Um, Brian is going to test it out on his computer. So in the meantime, I'm going to make this video of me playing the new Fantastic Beast VR that just came out. It's the first VR video that I've made, so uh, I'm wearing my Harry Potter um, my Harry Potter shirt, which is the wanted and dangerous shirt, and then I also have my Harry Potter pajamas on, so got everything under control, so yeah, let's do it. I asked myself, what should I call this show, and said I don't fucking know, so that's what I called it. Let's do this. We're going to do some magic. Oh yeah. This is like a room scan kind of thing. Oh, oh, hello. Splendid. Hello. Hi. Off you go. Who, me? No, let's do it. That was fun. All right. Uh, good game. Good game. Must buy. Oh. Oh, that's weird. All right, hopefully everything works out really well. Welcome Ooh. to my shed. I do make yourself at home, and feel free to take a closer look at anything that catches your eye. I feel extremely tall. This is definitely very strange. This better be worth- There are plenty of things to explore. But how about pointing your wand at the potion bottles on my desk and the shelf behind? Have a look at the magnifying glass next to the scroll on the desk. Or see what happens when you point your wand at the papers on the chair to the right of the All door. Alright, dude, chill out. Now, well we'd best get started with my creatures. That didn't You'll do need to anything. prepare a few things before you meet each of them. To begin with, point your That's wand all. at the scroll on my desk and choose one. It's, it would be cool. Okay, let's see. Okay, this is like a, a non-moving thing. I can't wander around anywhere in here. And everything seems kind of a, a little bit off. It's kind of weird. Let's check out the bow truckles. There's absolutely no head tracking here, like no movement. There's no reason for me to be standing. Just trace the form you see in front of you with your one. Nice. I did it. I did it. Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! Sorry. Bow truffles are intensely shy creatures, so to really? get them to come down from their tree and meet you, I suggest okay. preparing something to help coax them towards you. They're particularly partial to fairy eggs, so let's collect some for them as a treat. Everything moves very strange as well. Okay, how do I... Collect fairy eggs. Are they on the bottom? Ugh, dang it. I keep on wanting to move. Alright. Oh, there are none there. Wait, try the next leaf. I feel like, uh... I'm not really doing much. Wait, well then you found some. Now, pick each one off from the leaf with your wand and place it in the pot. Okay, that's better than... Like, a lot of this is kind of scripted. I might have to get a refund for this. <laughs> It's unfortunate too because I really love, I love Harry Potter. I love the movie and everything too. And it's just this is just not great uh, so far. Like I said, everything looks very strange. There, oh, got another one. There we go. Wonderful. Let's make a noise. All done. Now point at the door to go out to the courtyard and meet the boat. Let's do it. Let's load. Let's get into that loading screen. Yeah. This is... Okay. The tree with the bow truckles is just to the left of the bamboo forest and to the right of the pagoda. So, man, I'm I'm super bummed at this. Like, it's cool. It's you know, it's kind of 3D and everything. The tree with um, the bow truckles is just right there. Um, but it's it's like a scan, so it's not as clear. I guess you could Follow say. The instructions on the scroll. Let's see if we can help the bow truckles feel less shy. Right. Let's do the magic. There we go. Perfect. It's kind of weird that they don't have you say any names or any words. Oh. I've Yay. left instructions to help. The bow truckles are certainly ready for something to eat. Follow right, the instructions so on the scroll. And let's see if we can help the bow truckles feel less shy with some fairy eggs. Scloopy doop. I think I did it. Are you guys less shy? I don't know what that spell was. Oh. Huh. Those are fairy eggs. That's a tiny little fairy that you just ate. This is disgusting. Oh no. So bow truckles have been known to sometimes attack oh. woodcutters if they feel their homes are being threatened. Uh -oh. Perhaps best try offering him some wood lice to calm him down. 
Now, quick, follow the instructions on the scroll. There we go. It's a pretty unassuming wand. Is this supposed to be his wand? If it is, I'm not supposed to be using it. You know, oh. That's gross. Everything seems so... Like, this wand is on a different plane than everything else, it seems. It's very strange. Like... Oh, well done. I'm not interacting like with said, that thing at all. With them being so shy, it can actually be tough to get Botruckles to meet oh, people. Oh, man. Uh, head back to my shed and just look at the scroll for what to do next. Alright. What? Do I have to feed him again? Oh. Yeah, that's the same thing. We already did that. I guess I'm going over there. Man, that was just... <laughs> so much loading. This is really cheap. This is definitely, so far, definitely not worth ten dollars. Let's do, let's do a little bit more. So I definitely want to keep on giving it a try. Make sure that we're still recording over there. Audio. Still okay. deciding which of my creatures to meet next. Well, perhaps yeah, you could yeah, help yeah. me out and check my own. Oh, that side. should okay. I let's would see egg now. you to hatch any second now, so it would be great if you wouldn't mind going and see how the little one's getting along. Uh, I'm checking out the Thunderbird, dude. Chill out. Let's show you how to assemble this box to release a rare bird call, a Native okay. American method of calling the powerful Thunderbird. I'm totally standing for no reason, by the way. Like none of this. This doesn't. There's no like spatial tracking in any way. So I need to make uh, that, that one, that one. Excellent. You've successfully completed the spell. And now to the Thunderbird. But take care, as he's a wee bit sensitive to strangers. So this could be wonder... quite a challenge. Yeah. I wonder if this is JK Rowling approved. Or Rowling approved. That's a, that's a question for me. We well, can't miss the Thunderbird Where's enclosure. The he's right there. Yeah, I know. Oh man, I'm not wearing my straps like a noob. Alright. I don't like to have favorites. But it's hard not to be taken aback by the Thunderbird. What a creature. Well, let's see. I rescued let's Frank in see. Egypt. He was being held against his will, and I promised to return him to his natural habitat. Let's see habitat. if this is as incredible. Oh, he's sensitive to strangers, so please approach him be. with caution. Oh, cool. He looks small. He's shrunk. He's tiny. He looks so small compared to the way he was before. Alright, let's do this one. None of these are really challenging or anything like that. Uh, but like this, it's it's supposed to be, I'm sure this is just supposed to be some sort of experience, you know. Not as much a game, but... This should have been free, man. This should have been free. Let's do whatever this is. There we go! I don't know what I did. There's no explanation. Oh, okay. You just show him. That was the show off spell. Show off he is your wing -igus. Oh, Tractor is now playing well, Warframe. That was, you that's certainly nice have a way with Frank. It's rare that he trusts anyone, really. Ugh. It's impressive. People wanting to move up to him. Feel free to spend more time with him, or you can just head no, back and meet him. feel free to go back this way. Do boring stuff. Let's do one more thing um, before we give up on this. Uh, this. If this is a short episode, I apologize, but this is very. I'm a huge Harry Potter fan. I'm a huge Fantastic Beast fan, and this is such a letdown. Cool. Let's mess around with a few things. I mean, it's kind of cool to see this in a in a in a three D. Still deciding which of my creatures to meet next. Well, perhaps like, you could help me out and check my Okami nest then. I've an egg due to hatch any second now, so it would be great if you wouldn't mind going and see how the little one's getting along. Um, yeah, I know, I heard you before. It's it's cool to see this in like a three D like capacity. You know, it's not something that, of course, you would have have seen before, but it's interesting. But it's like it's just. Uh, anyway, it's not as magical. What did he say he wanted? 
Um, I guess let's just go out there without doing anything with those guys. He said that he wanted to go, what's this thing? Nothing that we can go to. I'm, I may be unprepared. Right, well, he must just... be around here somewhere. He can't have gone far. He's just a baby. Oh. Well, where is he at? You gonna give me any hints? No? Just... I'm on a camera! Oh, over there. Oh! Oh, shit. All right. <laughs> All right, chill out. Calm down. The remarkable creature. Yeah. It's the iridescent pretty. Yeah, that's cutie. So yeah, beautiful. Cutie. The alchemies are quite remarkable, you know. They're coranoptixic, you see, which means they okay. can shrink or grow to fit available space. Cool. That's why I recommend trying to keep a teapot handy, just in case you need to make the alchemy a little I easier to handle. I remember that part of the movie. And... Oh, there's a teapot. I don't know why you would specifically require a teapot. You can just fit them into all kinds of things. I don't know what I just did. I'm just doing... This is very irresponsible of me. Okay. Did I piss you off? Oh, a nice wing. Yeah, I see it. Cool. Uh, like, I'm just... Want, I'm... You know what? I, I, I specifically recall Professor Snape saying, There will be no foolish wand waving. And look at me. I'm doing... Uh, look at this foolish wand waving. I don't know what's going on. I have, there's no, there's no learning here. Wand waving foolishly. Oh, hey look, a roach. Go get it. Go get it. All right. <laughs> Good catch. I think it was tiny though. That had to have been very unsatisfying. Well done. Bravo. Especially considering just how fast he um, grew. <laughs> you can stay and watch thing. the youngster a little longer. Or if you want, you can just return back to the courtyard. I want to see the moon guys. Let's turn back to this. Those, I want to see those weird big eyed like. <laughs> oh, what's over here? Ah, uh, well, it looks like you might need to entice this creature out before you can meet it. Oh. Uh, head back to my shed and just look at the scroll for what to do next. All Firstly, right, just guess... point your wand at the sign over there and return to the courtyard. Recording, recording, recording. We're good still. All right. Glad that he's still playing Warframe. Uh, let's go back in here. I think the the size of that the it doesn't look correct. I'm sorry if I'm facing the wrong way this whole time too. I just <laughs> I'm getting mixed up. Um, let's do one more. I got to do the Niffler because he's adorable. They're, they're, they're just too adorable not to go meet the Niffler. And I'm sure that if Jin... Jin doesn't have any idea that I'm recording this because I just decided to do it. I'm sure if she knew that I was doing this, oh, she no. would be the so gone angry. Again. Of course he has, little bugger. If I didn't... Oh, wait, no, wait a second. What? I think he's if I didn't do borrow. Niffler. Uh-huh. Right. I've got a plan to entice him out. Okay. So he has a predilection for anything shiny. And Shiny. I know he's had his eye on a few of my belongings, so yeah. let's go and gather them from around the courtyard and see if we can use that to tempt oh, him out. No, that sounds right. fun. So point your wand at the door and... Look, there's... I think there's a coin. Let me get this coin right here. Nif I can't get that one. Borrowing creatures that can be found across Great Britain. Yeah, no, okay. Let's go get this stuff. Let's do it, because this is fun. Apparently. Where? Oh. Found one. It's coming at me weird. Alright. It's just a button. That was a huge button. Button. Got it. Let's see. Let's go over here. See if there's anything over here. Oh, that didn't work. You found the coin. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you know. You know me. Take a look at the scroll over there for instructions and see Why if you're out? up to the task. I'm gonna do that. I'm, I'm good. Let's go back. Find all these little pieces of important stuff, apparently. Um, let's go over here. Let's see if we can find the rest of the stuff. 
Well, he must be around no, here somewhere. No, no. He can't have gone far. He's just no. a baby. I'm good. Is that something over there? No. All right, let's uh, go back. Hmm. Uh, let's go this way. Ah, oh, that's where the uh, the obscurus is. Ah, right, we got anything? Well, it looks. There we go. Good show. You found the belt buckle. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I just used my eyes. I mean, so, like I said, some of these are cool. I just, I wish that it was cooler. <laughs> a weird thing to, a weird thing to say. This is cool, but it needs to be cooler. But it does. It does need to be cooler. All right, can I go where the? What the fuck? Um, I just figured this out. It's very strange. Do I need to catch all of them? Alright, this is... Can I just... Can I stop doing this? Let go! Thank you. Jeez. That was not... I need... Um... So it starts to glow... Did we... We didn't go over here. No, did I... Did I already come over here? I don't think so. Uh, there's ah. that. Splendid. You've collected all the shiny pieces you need to try to awesome. the Niffler. Cool. Right. So let's yeah, go to the Niffler burrow. It's just under the tree in the courtyard. What, that tree over there? I think I know which one. That one. All right, let's see this little guy. Oh, oh look right. at all that gold. Time to meet the Niffler. All right, time to do a Let's random... present him with the shiny items and see what he makes spell. of them. You know why it's pointless? Because there's no reason that I have. I could just show him the stuff. I didn't have to do a spell. What did that spell do? Hey, Niffler! What? Hey! I think it's doing the trick. Yes, here he comes. Here comes a Niffler. Oh. You know what I got enough stuff, man? That one is just a... There you go. Yeah! Now that he's here, complete the gesture in front of you with your wand to get to know him better. We see what he's hiding in his pouch. We don't want him to have his paws on anything he shouldn't now, do we? This well, why not see him play him with his collection? Alright, Whoa! Okay. Oh, you! Yo, get out of there! Get out of there! Stop with you, order! You greedy little... You greedy little platypus! Huh. You... He has a, uh... Here's a Time Lord pouch. I just thought of something that might be a little bit disturbing. What if Hermione's pouch was made out of Niffler pouches? Her purse? Her, like, magical purse? It's made out of a Niffler pouch. I'm gonna go ahead and say that that's probably the case. What is this? Oh, is it a pendant to that or something? Yeah? What am I... Happened. That was quite brilliant. By all means, stay a while with this little fellow, or you can return to the court. Uh, yeah, yeah. All right, now I'm going to return to the world, the real world, because this is very disappointing. Anyway. Um, oh, hey, there you guys. No. Anyways, uh, the video stopped probably, but that's okay, because it wasn't... There was nothing going on. So, thanks for watching. Um, if you guys like this, maybe I'll do some more VR videos in the future who knows i don't know but thanks for watching guys make sure you like comment subscribe and all that stuff and i'll see you next time bye